She'll be right. How far has that gotten us? Loads of sprained wrists and broken limbs. But when we look at this earth, after centuries of this philosophy, what have we done? Earth Mother, Papa Tuanuku, what have we done? We have torn down and sucked dry this planet that has done nothing but provide, nurse, and bewilder us. We have let it come down to greed, carelessness, and politicians' morals. Valuing money, money over natural wonders, rainforests into plantations. It is an irrefutable fact that nature is performing a disappearing act. Some people are bright sparks, shining in this dark future of floods, erosion, expansion, evasion of responsibility. There is a chance that lies with these people who can spot the right from the wrong and a chance that we don't deserve. Time is the enemy, but we humans have conquered time before. We have rescued whole species from extinction. Can we do the same for our home? We created this mess, and we can reverse it. Spider-Man fans will know, great power comes with great responsibility. We have a choice of ice cream flavors, if you will, a choking, a flavor of choking smoke and animal corpses, or that of clean air, wild berries, and a green future. Ah, so difficult. We can succeed, it is possible. The world can begin to thrive, it is possible. We find sharks and a plethora of other animals scary. There is a phobia for almost anything hairy. This pales in comparison to the danger of air pollution. Some can see no resolution. The billionaires need to see the scope and begin to reel in the rope. By 2027, climate change could be irreversible, non-reimbursable. How do we feel anything but defeat when there is always bad news to make hope bittersweet? You might remember how I mentioned politicians and their morals. Let them quell their inane quarrels and unite to face a problem greater than any individual. Together, we are quite formidable. Together, we can make a stand and come out of a deluded cloud cuckoo land. There is only one earth, only one chance. A sense of optimism in the form of activism. Surely you can lend a hand, save the earth from becoming a wasteland? It will take a lot of effort. It is a job we all need to undertake before the damage we have done makes the whole world shake. Whatever you do, just please don't be one of those people who think they can get away scot-free. Pavatuanuku, Earth Mother, what have we done? After centuries of this philosophy, what will we do?